but it's more to that when it comes to these kids. A great coach who could cost his team a trip to the playoffs. That's if the school doesn't bench him for the start of next season. And we told you about the ultimatum here made by the Whippeal Board of Directors here. Now Pittsburgh's Action News 4 reporter Bo Berman is live in Penn Hills tonight where parents, even players, are weighing in. Bo. Yeah, Janelle, Andrew, that's correct. Uh, people packed this board, uh, school board meeting tonight to talk about various issues, including the coach. Uh, some accuse him of swearing at parents, and others say he gives preferential treatment to some players. Both criticisms leveled against Coach Dan DeRose here at this meeting. Some parents say it's so bad the board should, con should consider whether or not he gets to keep his job. Now, in this meeting tonight, parents came to the podium uh, to discuss DeRose. They complained to the board about the head basketball coach coach's behavior claiming he's treated their children unfairly and sworn at parents. The Whippeal, of course, in the backdrop here, has placed sanctions against Penn Hills after the team's season-ending playoff game when DeRose reportedly interacted with game management, quote, in a profane way. However, quite a few star players on the team did show up tonight and spoke in support of Coach DeRose, but some parents argued that favoritism towards those very players is part of the problem. Listen now first clips of two parents upset with the coach and then to the team's starting point guard. Because with these other star athletes, they're great guys. They don't understand what it is to be a parent when you talk to a coach and he talks to you like you're six. Okay, I'm a taxpayer. I'm a grown man. I don't expect to be talked like that when I'm paying your salary. We've had our athletic program censured by the WPIL. Our basketball program is on probation. They've taken away a preseason game, all of because of the decisions, the inappropriate behavior, the ineffective communication exuded by Coach DeRose. He's one of the most positive male figures in my life at, at the moment. And so I just want him, I just want everybody to know that he's not a bad person and what everybody's making it out to seem like. Some mixed opinions there. Those Whippeal sanctions are under appeal. And meanwhile, I talked to the coach tonight. He told me that uh, he understands parents will try to protect their kids, but that he has to make tough decisions for the good of the team. Reporting live tonight from Penn Hills, Bo Berman, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.